This is MC Codger saying welcome back. This is episode 64, and we are off to, well, we're off to the end, but first we're off to the nether to get us some blaze rods. Remember, we have to activate that nether portal in which we need, uh, in order to do that, we need some eyes of ender, uh, which needs two things. We got ender pearls last time by summoning and killing some endermen, and now we need to head to the nether to uh, get us some blaze uh, powder. Well, we'll get blaze rods by killing blazes, uh, and we'll uh, then turn those blaze rods into blaze powder. Well, off we go to the nether. We're going to uh, uh, try and get these blazes with snowballs. I just figured, okay, we'll try and kill them with snowballs. Might, might not be the brightest idea, but I think it'll be fun. So, uh, let's go and we'll make, first we'll make us a little safe house out of snow. And I got plenty of snow. We'll make a safe house out of snow and then we'll, uh, go on blaze hunting. Okay, here's our very simple snow house made of snow. And, uh, <laughs> we got the essentials in here. Kind of like an igloo, only square. Term, I've gotten a lot, a lot of blocks of snow and if you take a shovel, and you break one, you get four snowballs. Okay, so I made my little house here in the nether out of snow, pretty near to the fortress that we found uh, hey, using Minotaur. And uh, let me put my snowballs back here where I can get at them. So snow uh, does not burn. So here in the nether, now I don't know for sure if it will eventually melt. I'm hoping it doesn't. Because uh, if it does, it'll drop me in a lake of lava. Uh, so what I want to do is go up here and see if I can find a blaze and start shooting at a blaze. Uh, there's one. Could I kill that blaze with... Look at that! I di Did I? I don't know. Can't tell for sure if I did or not. He did not drop a blaze rod if I did kill him. Okay, I need to find me a blaze. Okay. Now let me see if I can go find a blaze. I had to cut a, a little into this. Ro oh, looky there. I got a bunch of them. They're shooting at me. Oh, no, they're getting me. Look out. Oh, no, I'm on fire. Let me go in here for hold on for hold on a sec. Uh oh, they're they're not the best aims in the world, are they? Of course I'm not either. <laughs> See I need to get them. What I need to do is I need to get them not over that lava. I need to get them where I can where when they drop their blaze rods I will be able Yum yum yum. Now let's regenerate. I need them to I need to be able to fetch the blaze rod when they drop it. And if they're just hanging over that lava field, I'm not gonna be able to do that. Because I got a blaze spawner right over there. Let's see what's going on up here. See if I can get one just as he comes out of this spawner. And hope that there aren't any others coming after me. Come on now. Rutro. Shoot, die, die, die. Oh, I got him. I got him. And there's the blaze rod. Got it. Okay, now. Rutro. He's getting me. I'm starting to burn. Okay. Well, I got my one blaze rod anyway. I'm going to need more than that, though. Uh, there's another one. Oh, oh, there's several of them. They're shooting at me. They're shooting at me. Okay, I'm running out of snowballs. I got one. Got another one. Okay, whoa! Uh, okay, I know, I know. Ah! 
I better eat something. Come on, regen, regen here. Uh -huh. Now, let me get my more of my snowballs and fight my way back. I got one blaze rod. I should be able to pick up a few more at that spawner if I can. Let me see here. There's this. There we go. Whoa! They got me way outnumbered! Okay. Okay. I know. I know. I'm hurting. Let me get out of here. Oh, look at that. Well, I did get my blaze rod. That's how it's done. Uh, I, I am able to look there, and I still have my blaze rod because I used keep inventory rule, game rule, keep inventory true, so I still have my game blaze rod. So I am, uh, <laughs> I've got my blaze rod. You know, I can always go back there. We can go back there, and we can get some more blaze rods. And uh, anyway, that's how it's done. You can do battle with snowballs and win <laughs> on a good day. So, yeah, let's get our Ender Pearl, see if we can create our Eye of Ender, and, uh, and, and see if we can get the stuff that we need to activate the End Portal. Hold on. Okay, here we are back uh, near the end, end Portal room, and I've got a bunch of Ender Pearls here, and i got some Blaze Rods here, and we're going to make us some Eyes of Ender. First thing I need to do is take these blaze rods and turn them into blaze powder, which you just do like this. You can actually don't even need a um, crafting table to do that. Turn those blaze rods into blaze powder. We'll get a bunch of this blaze powder here. Okay. I think it's I think it's twelve Isander we need. I think that'll do. And then uh, the Ender Pearl goes right beside the blaze powder to create your eye of ender okay so let's pull some more ender pearls there and let's make a bunch of eyes of ender and that's what we're going to need to activate the uh, uh, to activate the end portal so let's uh, uh, run down there let's go on down and activate it Okay, before I go in there, uh, I really don't like silverfish. <laughs> Did I tell you that? I don't. Having used Minotaur, I know the coordinates of that monster spawner. So, I'm going to use the fill command to fill that space where the spawner currently is, and those coordinates are negative 6, 9, 2, 17, 24, 14. Okay, and then I'll input those uh, numbers twice. For the two corners of the fill command. And I'm just going to fill it with a torch. And we'll see what happens. One block is filled, and now let's go see. Uh, oh, there's, they're in there, aren't they? We have, may have to kill some of these guys. There's one. Okay. Now, oh, there's another one. Stop! guys. Okay, let's see if that got all of them. I hope. And look, the monster spawner has been replaced by a torch. So, I just had to kill the remaining ones that were still here. And here we have the frame. I've already got one Eye of Ender in that frame. Now, let's just fill the remainder of them. We'll put one there, one there. Um, Got to be real careful. Don't fall in the lava. Okay, now, and when the last Eye of Ender goes in there, it should activate the portal. And looky there. There is our portal 
to the end, the end portal. And then you just step through and you're in the end, which we're not going to do just yet. I want to invite MC Codex to come with me into the end because, yeah, MC Codex uh, is better at fighting things in the end than I am. So I'm going to have him come with me to the end and then we'll, we'll kind of see what's going on at the end to finish this game. But I don't want to do that this episode. So uh, until then, this is MC Codger saying... Once again, we'll see you next time on Codger's World.